This is just a quick video for my wife to reference if she ever has to do this. And if you find it useful too, well good. Enjoy. My wife's 2018 CX-5 is our nicest car. And it's gonna get a little bit of attention today because this is rotted and needs to be replaced. All right, let's see how this works. So I think I need to take this off. Easier than I thought. So now with this off, it should rotate all the way up. And then this rotates, it's gonna stop a little bit, rotate past it, it'll go boom, and then, then it should just come out like that. So now I have to make sure that the one I'm putting on matches that. So this is the wiper blade that I got, and it came with these four attachments. And when you compare it to the original, well, you know these two, too small, you can toss those. And then this one has these extra knobs that I don't need. So this is the chicken dinner right here. So I'll put this on the new one. So on this one, there's four protrusions that match those slots. So line them up and push forward. There you go. So now let's go put it on. So this crescent here receives this, this rod that goes across it there. And it's on. Now take off the plastic. Sit it down and replace this. There you go. Get rid of the old stuff. And I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna wipe this down real quick. So I just put some windshield wiper fluid on my little shop rag. There we go. Now we have a fresh wiper blade. And this is why you rotate your tires. This tire looks good, plenty of life. And this one is hanging on. This was on the front, this was on the back. So we'll get a few more thousand miles of it, but we'll end up buying tires sooner than we would have if we'd rotated them on time. As the miles continue to rack up on our 2018 Mazda CX-5, I will continue to document everything I do to keep it in good working order. If you'd like to follow along, hit subscribe. If you'd like to see the things I've already done, check out the playlist. Thanks for watching. Take care.